Sea turtles have been on Earth for 150 million years, so it stands to reason they would have evolved some amazing adaptations to help them survive this long. One such adaptation is the ability to navigate across the globe and make it back to the exact same coastline they were born on. So just how do they do this? So scientists have discovered that turtles, as well as whales, lobsters, sharks, salmon and even humans all possess the ability to detect electromagnetic fields. You see, the Earth itself is a magnet. The Earth's core is a giant ball of iron spinning so rapidly that it produces a magnetic field. But despite being a hundred times weaker than the magnets on your fridge, this field is still strong enough to cause the aurora and to leave a magnetic signature in rocks. One such rock is the mineral magnetite, so called because it is the strongest naturally occurring magnet on Earth. And it turns out that turtles, as well as humans, possess concentrations of magnetite within their skulls that help us detect the Earth's magnetic field. As the turtle embryo grows inside its egg, the magnetic field from the beach that it's on is imprinted into the magnetite in its skull, ensuring that every turtle has a permanent reminder of just how to get home. Researchers at the Lohman Lab at the University of North Carolina placed loggerhead turtle hatchlings in little harnesses and exposed them to magnetic fields, simulating different locations around the Atlantic Basin. As soon as they switched the magnetic field, the hatchlings instantly started swimming in the opposite direction. GPS tracking has enabled scientists to monitor turtle populations across the Atlantic. Turtles catch the Gulf Stream current from their nesting grounds in the west, across to feeding and breeding grounds in the east. One such loggerhead was tagged and released in North Carolina. It was expected that he would follow the Gulf Stream across to Spain. But despite having spent a decade in captivity, he knew exactly where he needed to be. Satellites tracked him, spend a year swimming 11,000 kilometers against the current to reach his mating grounds in the Cape Verde Islands. Recent research has also found a group of proteins called cryptochromes in the eyes of robins and sea turtles. This protein reacts to magnetic fields, allowing the turtles to actually see the Earth's magnetic field. So the next time you're lost, why not try putting that phone away and see if you can be more turtle and hone into your own magnetoreceptive abilities.